Hey everyone, Michael Durr, video producer at Luminous Landscape. And in this video, I'm gonna talk about the Tamarack Anvil 27 Pro Camera Bag. I've been using a Tamarack bag forever and I'm amazed at the durability and functionality that it has delivered. But all good things must come to an end. It's time for an upgrade. I've recently traveled to the Palouse in Washington State, Maui, and San Francisco, and the Anvil 27 has been with me every step of the way. It's lightweight, well-balanced, comfortable, and durable. One of the simple things I like about this camera bag is that it just stands up when you set it on the ground. The outside pockets are great for small personal items or things that I need to access quickly. The vented back makes the bag comfortable to wear in hotter conditions or on longer hikes. Some people might be critical of the fact that you can't access this bag quickly while wearing it. I've never had an issue just setting the bag down and reaching in to grab my gear. I do understand the fact that some people like to access their bag as like a side pouch or have the ability to swing it around and open it up and grab your camera. If I was shooting street photography or at a crowded event, I would rather have a bag with easier access. However, I would also want a smaller bag in that scenario. But when I'm hiking, I want a nice balanced system that I can go a long distance and still feel comfortable. So it really depends on what your style of shooting is and the amount of gear you need to travel with. I wanna talk about one of my favorite parts about this camera bag, and that's this removable waist belt. So you can see there's this very large Velcro area, and this attaches through here. And it can be a little hard to get in, but once it's in, it's in, and that's the important part. So now you're locked in and this belt is not going to move. Now when I put this on, swing it around, and both Kevin and I really, really like this belt. So now it's fully strapped in and right now the bag is almost completely off my shoulders. So if you're going on a long hike, this is perfect and going to be super comfortable for a long day. Being able to take the belt off makes storing the bag in overhead compartments much easier. I also like that there are many areas to clip things to the outside and a quick release area to attach a tripod. My only real complaint about this camera bag is that it doesn't have a side water bottle pouch. They do sell an attachment or an accessory piece that allows you to attach a water bottle, but it's something that I feel like should just be included in the bag. Let's have a look inside. The compartments inside have customizable foam dividers to keep your gear well protected. I also like that this bag is about 10 inches deep so I can take my larger DSLR with grip and tripod mount and stand it up inside the bag with no issues. I like the see-through pockets on the backside so I can see exactly what I need without opening and digging around inside the pockets. So this bag holds most 15-inch laptops. However, I shoot a lot of video, so I use that area of the bag to store my audio gear or other video accessories. I have not had to use the Rainfly yet, but I store it in an area with a smaller lens or something that might need a little more protection. Overall, this is a great camera bag and one that I'm sure will last me a long time. It retails for $269.95, and there's a link in the description below. Another big benefit of this line of bags is that Tamarack has developed a number of different sizes and shapes, so you can really find one that works best for you. If you like this video, be sure to hit the subscribe button and visit us at luminous-landscape for access to thousands of articles, videos, reviews, and tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the Luminous Landscape. Poor bat. She's still good. <laughs>